Hello everyone. I am Yolanda Harper here with Alina Klein and Toby is right here and Hobbs is over in his crate. <laughs> we are joined by all the fluffing nutterness today. Fluff. All the fluff. All the fluff. Mm -hmm. All the fluff. We wanted to share some exciting news with you guys today. Yeah. So we have a teen anxiety group starting next month, which is very, very exciting. Mm -hmm. um, so many of our teens deal with anxiety and need a resource or resources to deal with it. And what we're doing here at Harper Therapy is offering a group for the social support component and kind of uh, getting some skills. So. so this is a very special offering for teenage girls ages 13 through 18 um, that we are going to be offering as a workshop in June mm -hmm. and then as a group um, for several weeks in July. So the workshop will be more concise and consolidated and the group will be more ongoing. Yeah. But we wanted to hop on today and give you guys a little sneak peek mm -hmm. about some of the content of the group. If mm -hmm. you're on, hi, mm -hmm. welcome. Um, so we have shared some information with you guys before mm -hmm. about anxiety and what that looks like, what that feels like, our teens' uh, experience of anxiety. Mm -hmm. But Elena's going to share with us today kind of a hack for how to deal with anxiety, how we can help support our teens in um, having some tools to manage their feelings of anxiety. Mm -hmm. So a lot of time with anxiety, it really is, um, it can pull you out of the moment very fast and it's hard to focus. Um, so one exercise that we're going to be learning about in the group is the 5-4-3-2-1 game. It's very simple. I like it a lot. Um, so the first part of this game is just naming five things you can see in the room with you. So you know, right now I can see the lamp light, I can see the sun shining in from the outside, I can see the flowers on the carpet. You can't see them, but I can see them. <laughs> um, you know, I can see these different things in the room, and I'm just getting my focus outside of that feeling inside of me, that anxious feeling. The next thing, the four, is name four things that you feel. So this is kind of mindfulness, you know. Right now I can feel the pillow against my back. Um, if I reach down, I can feel Toby's fur mm -hmm. on my fingers. I can feel my feet on the floor. Um, you know, I can feel the air from the air condition on my arms. So I can feel these things uh, in the room. The next one, the three, is naming three things that I can hear right now. So obviously I'm talking, so I can't uh, hear myself talking. Um, you know, I hear the jingle of the dog's collar. Mm -hmm. You know, I hear... Yolanda's breath, I hear these things around me that, um, that are taking me and bringing me into the moment. Two things that I can smell right now. This is always a hard one for me because, you know, usually I'm in a place where I'm like, what, what is there to smell? Or, or two things you like to smell. Yeah, yeah. So I can even have like a lavender essential oil and smell mm -hmm. that or, you know, something that, that kind of gives me some peace, brings me back to the moment. Mm -hmm. um, and then the last one in one is naming one good thing about yourself. One. And, you know, that can be hard for some people to do, just naming one good thing, but hopefully it isn't hard for our teenagers. What's, a, so. what's one good thing about you? Um, I like my smile. Yeah? <laughs> yep. Yeah. Yeah. And I can name a couple more, but... Yeah. Yeah. Your smile. What about you? You do have a lovely smile. <laughs> I am an empathic badass. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. Love it. <laughs> Superpower. <laughs> So, one of the benefits about doing this 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 game is that it brings our prefrontal cortex back online. So, mm -hmm. when we're anxious, we're out of the, you know, kind of the calm, rational thinking part of our brain. Our um, emotional brain is on overdrive, and so it spins our thoughts. We think that we're thinking, but we're not thinking healthy, good, productive thoughts. Mm -hmm. um, so, this re-engages the prefrontal cortex, and it's super simple, super easy to remember, mm -hmm. and you can do it in any order. Right. So, even if you, it's, it's five things that you hear, right. um, you can kind of mix and match and mix it up. Exactly. Awesome. Exactly. Get out of that fright. No, fight, flight, freeze. freeze. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. So, that is a little sneak peek of what our teens are going to be experiencing when, they, um, when we offer our group. Our workshop in June, our group in July. Um, contact us at Harper Therapy for more information about how to get your team signed up and involved in that. And we are looking forward to that offering. We hope that you are having a great day. Bye, everyone.